Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Java interview questions. That is, can constructors be overloaded in Java programming? The answer is yes. We can overload the constructors. We can create duplicate constructors inside the same class when they differ in the number of parameters, the type of parameters, the order of parameters. So we can overload the constructors in Java with practical demonstration. I am going to show you that we can absolutely overload the constructors in Java. For that, I'll switch to the Eclipse IDE. Here, I'll create a new class, a fresh new class. Constructors overloading demo. I'm just giving a random class name. Click on finish. So the class name is kind of very big, guys. I would like to make it small. I'll just make it a COD, constructor overloading demo. Okay, COD stands for constructor overloading demo. Pour the mouse on this and, you know, rename this file name. Okay, rename this so that the file name and uh, the class name looks same. Done. So now the file name and class name are same. Now inside this, I would like to create a constructor. I'll just say public. Public. The constructors will not have any return type. Okay, the constructor constructors won't have any return type, guys. So I should not be mentioning void. Okay, so void or no return type will be there, and the name of the constructor should match with the name of the math, uh, class. Okay, the name of the constructor should match with the name of the class. So same COD name I have with you. Circular brackets starting of the constructor and ending of the constructor. Okay, this one constructor system dot out dot print inside inside constructor. Okay, now if I copy paste the same constructor here as it is, I'm going to get an error. It will simply say that duplicate method COD in type. Okay, the constructor is now duplicated guys because the name of the constructor, there are two constructors here in the same class and uh, the same name is there. Okay, if you because constructors will have the same name, you cannot have a different name for a constructor. Okay, either for this constructor or this constructor, they should hold the same name but how we can still have multiple constructors having the same name as a class name inside the same class. So there is a, there is one rule guys. Okay. If you want to overload something, either it can be methods or constructors in Java. We have to make sure that there are three rules for that. First rule is different. Okay. Uh, different number of parameters. Okay, they should have a different number of parameters, guys. Okay, they should have a different number of parameters. So here, zero parameters are there. What if I put something like this int a? You see, the error is gone. Now duplicate constructors can be created. Constructors having the same name can be created. Constructors will have the name as a class name only. Okay, but uh, duplicate names are allowed only when here zero parameters are there. Here one parameter is there. That's what is making the difference. I'll just plus A, I'll say, okay. Now, if I want to create one more uh, constructor, again, I'll get the error. Why? Because this constructor and this constructor have the same name and zero number of parameters, okay? And this constructor has one parameter. What if I put that single parameter here? Again, the error is still coming. Why? Because this constructor and this constructor have the same name. The second rule here is either the constructor should have different number of parameters to get overloaded inside the same class or they should have different type of parameters. They should have a different type of parameters. That is the second rule. Second, different type of parameters means what? Different type of parameters means here int a is there. What if here also one parameter is there? Here also one parameter is there. What if I make it double? Error is gone. Okay. Here zero, here one. So overloading is possible. But in this case, in the second case, here, here one parameter, here also one parameter. Count of the parameters is same, but the type of the parameters is different. That's what makes the different system dot order print Allen. Inside constructor. Here place A. Now next one. Public. COD. Here I'll say int A guys. Int A. Okay. And again the error is coming. Why? Because duplicate uh, method error will come because 
this constructor and this constructor are matching okay the same name name of the constructor is same at same time here number of parameters is same and the type of the parameters is same so i would like to increase the count of parameters uh, i'll say double b you see the error is gone because this one has only one parameter whereas this one has two parameters that what that's what made the difference inside constructor plus a plus b i'll say okay for now i'll create one more constructor i'll copy paste this constructor having the same name and uh, same number of parameters and same type of parameters first parameter is of int type second parameter is of double type so so there is one more role in constructors guys okay uh, if you want to overload the constructor either the constructor should have the different number of parameters or different type of parameters or different order of parameters different order of parameters in which their types are declared for example in this constructor first a parameter is declared with int type where the second parameter is declared with double type okay here also first parameter is int type second parameter is double what i make something like this first parameter double type double type and second parameter int type okay second parameter int type then you see error is gone the order in which the way uh, the parameters of this particular constructor are declared is changed okay the moment you change the order in which this uh, uh, param uh, this parameter types are changed right you see things got different okay so the answer is what guys can constructors constructors be overloaded in java the answer is yes guys constructors can be overloaded in java when they differ in the number of uh, parameters the type of the parameters okay again the number of parameters the order in which the parameters are declared uh, declared which type of parameters in which order they are declared okay first parameter in type here second parameter in type this second parameter double type first parameter double type like that okay so either the number of parameters or the type of parameters or the order in which the parameter types are declared okay makes the difference and uh, will allow the different constructors in same class to be overloaded so hope guys you got the answer for this question with practical demonstration so that's all for this session thank you bye bye